Ian Paul. That is a very aggressive start from Tommy Paul. Oh, that is huge. Shot making on show here. <sighs> He's done so well there. Stunner. <laughs> Mister Sirundulu challenge the call. Right baseline, ball is called out. That's got to be the end of the set, isn't it? Surely. Yeah. The call of the line umpire did not affect his return. Yeah, it's 100% right, I think, from Mohamed Layani. Game, yep. first set, Seri Unduru. Again, Paul. Oh, he's found enough of the line. Lovely touch. Well done. I think he's okay. Yeah, who knows? Oh, what a get that is. Well, there's a fair bit to ponder here. The physio's got a lot of work to do, you sense. Some diagnosis required. Currently Mr. just doing Paul the is assessment. Now receiving a medical timeout. Isn't it really? Yeah, I, I'm not sure what can be done for upper hip. You can't tape it or anything like that. Some painkillers and just, yeah, what the physio's doing is just keeping it loose. So Tommy Paul. Paul, despite the injury, has done a very good job. He's taken one, the second set, set and run right away with it. We're heading the distance. It's a beauty, a combination of shots from Paul.
come on. Torture for Tommy. There's the break. Tommy Paul in real trouble now. Magnificent point that was. Oh, it's cheeky. How's that for a start? Francisco Sorundolo becomes just the second Argentine ever to win an ATP Tour title on a grass court. He overcomes Tommy Paul, who was struck with injury halfway through the contest. Certainly limited his expectations, you feel. And what a season this man's having. He takes home the title on the south coast of England and prevails 6-4 in the third. Tom Pierce will present the Rothsay International Eastbourne Winners' Trophy.